Hey guys! So today I decided that I would do my top 10 spring lipstick colors. So these are my top 10 that I think are awesome and they are all drugstore, which is awesome! Alright, so the first one I want to talk about is the color that I'm wearing and it is Bear It All by Wet n Wild. It is one of their Mega Last lipsticks. They're kind of matte, but they're nice. They're not too drying. I really like them. And I dropped it. Bear It All is a really nice kind of brown nude color. It is very much on trend right now, so that's a nice one. And these Wet n Wild ones are only like $2, $1.99. I think I get them when they're like two for three. This next color is Maybelline's Matte Lipstick and it is Daringly Nude. And this is a little bit more of a pinky nude. It's very, very pretty. It looks beautiful on and yeah, I really like this color. It's very springy to me. into the bright fun colors for spring. This one is Don't Blink Pink. It is also from the Wet n Wild uh, Mega Last Collection. And this is the color I'm wearing right now. Isn't it pretty? I love this color. It's so, so bright and beautiful and just lovely. This next color is from the Maybelline Vivids collection. I think it came out last summer. And this one is Vivid Rose. And it is a very, very pretty, kind of bright pink, but a little bit corally rose color. That's it right there. I think it's really pretty and it's a great summer color. Awesome summer color. Well, spring. It's an awesome spring and summer color. This next color is also from the Maybelline Vivis collection and this one is Hot Plum and it is a very hot purpley color. As you can see, it's so pretty. So yes, I think this is also a really great shade and I think it would look good on most skin tones. This next one is also from the Mega Last Collection, and it is called Pinkerbell. This is a very, very bright, like, in-your-face, pinky, kind of corally color. Definitely very, very pink. It is not for the faint at heart. So this next one is also by Maybelline. Do you see a trend here? I like Maybelline. This one is from their new Blooms, Rebel Bloom co collection, and it is Lilac Flush. And this is a color, it is a very beautiful lilac color. And this, it actually looks really pretty on the lips. And it's very much one of the trends that's going on right now is these, um, pastel colors. So yeah, this is Lilac Flush. So this next one is another one from the Maybelline Matte Collection and it is Faint for Fuchsia. And I love this color. I think it's so pretty. And for those people who don't like high shine, this is still very fun and flirty, and I really like it. It is definitely very, very fuchsia, which is great. And it matches my hair. <laughs> the 
this next one is another Maybelline Vivids and it is Brazen Berry and this one is definitely a very purpley color but it does have a pink undertone which makes it very very wearable even for people who don't really wear much purple lipstick. So I really like this one because of how wearable it is and I do think it is perfect for spring because it's a nice bright fun color and yeah it's it's fun. in my top 10 spring colors is Flirty Fuchsia by Milani and it is a very bright beautiful fuchsia color and it's shiny and don't mind mine it got a little bit smushed I'm not really sure how I have a feeling somebody might have been messing with it when I wasn't paying attention but yes I really like this color I think it's very pretty and is definitely very wearable for pretty much every skin tone I think it's beautiful. So this is a great, great, great spring color and I love it. So those were my top 10 spring picks for lipsticks. I hope you enjoyed it. I know most of them were like Maybelline and Wet n Wild, but those are the brands that I tend to gravitate toward, and they have some great spring colors, and there is something for everyone there. If you're not bold enough to go after the lilac color, you can always go with something a bit more simple, like a nice nude, or just a pink that is not so in your face, like this one, which looks like it's crazy, but it's a really nice pink, and it's got that purpley undertone and it's just beautiful. So if you like videos like this, please give me a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you next time. Bye!